girl C. I'm just here to give you this message and I'm trying to do um, maybe I don't want to say daily word because that's definitely not happening don't have the time to do that but I will give you a weekly word how about that so we'll do that on Sundays look forward to it because I intend to keep myself what's the word accountable so what I am doing is just sharing this message with you guys. I hope it finds you guys well. Um, so I'm gonna do a quick three cards and I hope you enjoy it. Uh, the message that I got um, with these cards, I think that is pretty dope. It's decision, which is the pendulum. And then we have geomacy, which is patience. And then we have clouds, which is mystical. So these are all beautiful vibrations. Um, and the way that they're coming together in this, in this message for all of us is, you know, it's important for us to have all the information before we obviously go ahead and jump into any specific decisions that we need to be making for ourselves and others. Um, but it's very important for us to also know that we're being guided in the right times so you know like holding the understanding that you are being guided to do whatever it is that you feel positioned to do everything happens within divine timing so i am an advocate for patience i teach patience um and i try to have patience as much as i can for others and for me and that's a big one you know like having Patience for yourself is a completely different um, care regimen that you have to have, you know, like, because we as collective people, as a collective, often, you know, think about others and think about what others they can give others. And, you know, we, we often have more patience for others than you have for yourself because you set yourself to a sense of standard. So understanding that you're being guided wholly and truly by your spirit, by most high, you know, those are the only two co-creations that you would need is, you know, that between you, your spirit, and you and the most high. Those are the two that you need is the strongest. Um, you know, when I talk about the pendulum, also it's about making a decision um making the decision because it's going to obviously swing both ways as a pendulum does um you have to weigh your options find balance have patience um but when you utilize a pendulum for its magic and its energy uh the sensing takes a bit of time you actually uh, i teach a lot of my students pendulum work where i will hide something and they have to have the internal patience okay to find whatever it is that i've hidden in my shop you know for them so it's really a, a significant thing to to come up on is like to to find that patience within yourself you know like to taking that that experience in trying to not internalize it but have it on an external uh external forum where you have to share that same sense of patience that you're able to give to somebody else so easily understand that you are just as deserving as that and when you teach other people how to be things that means that you need to learn it the best so i know for myself i needed to learn patience and i'm very good at teaching patience because it's what i have always needed most to learn for myself so, um, you know, understanding that you are being guided right now by the most high, you have the clouds, the mystical understanding, um, looking to the clouds. Also, when you think about clouds, think about the shapes. Everybody sees something different. That's a very big thing for you guys to be aware of. Everybody sees something uh, different within the shapes of the clouds. That's the beauty of, of looking at something abstract is because everybody is going to have a different awareness of it you know so 
having that as an understanding. And then we have uh, geomancy, which is the, the act of having patience. And um, yeah, the act of having patience. Again, I'm hearing, that came through really interesting. Okay, so the thing that I'm hearing has to do with like a significant undertaking. Like, so if there is a specific task that you want to do, and I feel like that this is very much about a new, a new line of business. Now, if it is not, if you're not a business owner, um, I would say this has to do with maybe you creating something for yourself. Um, or if you are a business owner, this is definitely going to be something that is shifting out of what you currently do, but branches onto it. So, you know, they're saying multiple lines of income and stuff like so that's what I get, man. That's what I got. And I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, sorry, I have really bad lighting today because it's that golden time of day. Um, if you guys know about Frankie Beverly, you know that song. And um, yeah, golden time of day. You need to go spend it and enjoy it. Um, peace, love, light. I'll talk to you soon.